My name is Ron Gold and together with Three Tree Hill Lodge I've decided to make another series of short videos concentrating initially on legends and stories of the Voortrekkers. Now most South Africans know the story of Rachel de Beer so we're going to start with that one today. The De Beer family was reportedly living temporarily in a home somewhere which is on the escarpment of the Drakensberg Mountains. And um, when their cattle were brought in late one afternoon in advance of an approaching storm, it was discovered that a favorite bull calf by the name of Fricky was missing. And uh, Mr. De Beer and his farm laborers set out immediately to, to find the calf. And Rachelki, which simply means little Rachel, the daughter, 11 years old, and her little brother, Buti, uh, decided that they would have a look around closer to the house. But the storm came in very quickly, and soon there were howling gales and driving snow, and they lost sight of the house and became hopelessly lost. And after a while, Rachel realized that the cold was getting to them. And she found a termite mound, which had been partially hollowed out by an anteater. And using a stone and her freezing hands, she made the aperture larger. And eventually it was big enough. And so she took off her clothes, wrapped them round Booty, and pushed him into the ant bear hole. And then to make it even warmer, she lay over the top of it. There was great consternation back at the house, of course, when father returned from his search to find the children missing and uh, all night they staggered around as best they could but couldn't find her. In the morning the storm died down and one of the laborers eventually found the children. Rachel was dead from hypothermia but Butty was still alive and uh, the story of Rachel has gone down to I think epitomize the spirit of the Boer people. This is really the first part of our story and next week we're going to give you the second part and don't miss that because it will raise some question marks about the whole story of Rachel de Beer.